T minus 15 seconds. Guidance is internal. 12, 11, 10, 9. Ignition sequence starts. 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, 0. All engine running. Liftoff. We have a liftoff. 32 minutes past the hour. Liftoff on Apollo 11. Hello, rocket makers. Today is an exciting day. I got my Bluetooth. So this is the part that is the center of the rocket that will protect it from the uh, hot gases of the ejection charges and so on. And of course, the 3D printed portions will provide the facade. So um, as you can see, I'm missing a section that's not quite the length, but you're starting to get to uh, get a sense of how big this rocket actually is. I'm six foot two. It's already taller than me, and I still have the uh, launch escape system to go on the top. Um, it's not a small rocket. So there is still work to be done. As you can see, there's still a section missing that needs to be drafted. That should be completed by tomorrow, put on the printer, and uh, within a couple days, I should have the last of the structural pieces. You can see here, there are cutouts that will allow the through the wall fins to go in. I don't have the fins made yet, so they'll have to be made and holes cut in the blue tube accordingly uh, that will allow me to mount them. On top of that will go the, uh, the shroud that goes around the uh, four fins. The fins are going to be oversized because uh, certainly the Saturn V had gimbaled motors. This one does not. We'll want something a little better to uh, provide stability. For other parts of the rocket that aren't 3D printed, I need to get this bad boy running. So I talked a little bit about this in my welcome back video. This is my laser cutter. So I'm going to need this to cut the fins. Um, yeah, so that's a pretty uh, important piece. I've already done some work on this. Uh, I'm going to be continuing this over the next, uh, well, certainly in the next few days, probably the next few weeks, there will be a video out on this separately, uh, but that's going to be a key component for it next. There's a lot of things to do for it, uh, getting the air assist in, just getting it fired up and aligned and so on. But once I get that done, I can cut the fins and start the assembly of the actual rocket. So uh, we'll get something flying here soon. Stay tuned. There's a lot of exciting stuff coming up. If you want to see more on this and all the pieces that go into it, don't forget to uh, subscribe. And of course, if you like what you see, hit the like button. If you have any comments, feel free. And thank you to my awesome patrons who've uh, made a lot of what's happened up to now possible. Until next time. Roger, we got a roll. Tower clear. Roger, roll.